What's up, everybody? Back in with another episode of this bright ass light skin nigga. Sunny Daniel First of all, let's start off the day by saying, I'm a crackhead for coffee now. Vlogmas has turned me into a coffee crackhead. I put three tablespoons of milk in it and three tablespoons of sugar in it. 150 calories, roughly probably around 200. But that's all beside the point. It's Sims time. I see y'all got the Sims video to a thousand views in like two hours. Y'all crazy with these Sims videos, man. Y'all just gotta make sure y'all go check out my other videos too because they lit but today we're gonna go ahead and finish this up real quick it shouldn't take me that long tell me why i got a copyright claim on that last video though because they were saying that the, the uh, song I used was copyright and I got it from YouTube's library. Like, come on, bro. Calm down. Y'all know the day before KSI's fight, KSI and Logan fight, they copyrighted all my damn, um, what was it? Was it Until Dawn? Yeah, I think it was Until Dawn. They copyrighted all those videos, man. Claimed them under KSI. Like, he owns that game. It was crazy. It was like, man, what? I still haven't gone back and actually fixed them up yet, but I will eventually. I definitely will. All right, so I want to fix this up, man. Finish this up. I kind of want to do something different. Like, I kind of like this. This is kind of cool. Uh, it's definitely not something I'm going to do. It might be kind of cool. Maybe we throw the... See, I don't know. I want to go with the same basic old... I don't know. I kind of like this gray carpet, though. Can't, can't lie. No cap. No cap. You know what I'm saying? I can't lie. I can't lie. I say can't lie way more than I say no cap. Man, this coffee is good, man. Get you where it means something, man. Y'all wanna rock the hottest merch in the game? Well, go over to samedaniel.com slash shop, man, where you can get all the new merch that I drop. I got hoodies, t-shirts, pillows, phone cases coming, lanyards, all kind of stuff, man. So go over to samedaniel.com slash shop, get the hottest merch, man. I got it on right now, cause it's just so fly. Also, if you want my uncensored sim videos, you want access to all my content before it hits YouTube, and some content that never hits YouTube that's strictly exclusive, you gotta go over to the Patreon account, man. It's only $2.99 a month. That's 10 cents a day. That's damn near free. And I got a Discord now, man. Shout out to my homie Freedom. He set up a Discord for me so we can go over there. We can post memes. We can post girls. We can post all kind of stuff. Let's get back into the video. All right, I saw your comments. You said, don't make me make, make somebody else. Make somebody new. And I do have a household. I'm going to go ahead and show you all the household real quick. It was a household of people that I was going to put in the vault. But I decided not to put them in the vault because of that. So this dude, this is a playthrough that I haven't got to yet. But these two households right here i haven't completely finished but this is the one with all the girls in it like six fly honeys man all different types and then i want a household this household has got four dudes in it and they were going to be in the vault i think these two are in the vault and these two were going to be so they kind of like you know the rejects of the vault but like i'm gonna make it lit so it's, it doesn't feel that way and plus the dude in the uh the dude in the Cavs jersey looks like my nephew, so I might play through as him because he's pretty lit. But I definitely want to finish this up and make it look good, man. So first things first, there's no way to get upstairs. I realized that just now. There's absolutely no way to get up to the next level. Uh, now, I do have elevators from the mod that I got. Should I use the elevators is the real question. Because see, if I use the elevators, you know what I could do? I just came up with an idea. If that's split right there, that's two on this side, I could technically go ahead and make this the kitchen and then make this the hallway. Wasn't what I was expecting to do, but sometimes you gotta do things that you don't expect to do to make things work. You understand what I'm saying? See, like that. Then I can go ahead and pull this door over too because I really don't need... Now, do I even have this elevator? Where? What was that in? What was the elevator in? 
Shout out to all the people that buy merch, man. I just got an order yesterday. Who that order from? I'm shipping it out today. Keisha, Akleisha White. You know what I'm saying? Akleisha White. I don't know if I'm pronouncing your first name right, but shout out to you. Big shout outs to you. You know what I'm saying? E White. You feel me? E White.com. All right. So, where is this at? Where, probably electronics. That's what I'm thinking. Electronics miscellaneous. Yeah, there they go. All right. Working elevator. And then working elevator two, right? Residential. And then we got luxury. Yeah, fancy. All right. Since this is a college dorm in this fancy, let's go ahead and do this one. Now, I believe you can use. Is it one, two? I forgot how you do the elevators. Because you can have them on the same floor, but I forgot. Do you need like one and two? I think you just need two of the same one. I think. All right, so what we're going to do is we're going to just kind of park this truck in here some kind of way. Kind of where it's not in the way, but it's still there. That kind of vibe. I'm going to go ahead and, and box this in. Same upstairs. Go ahead and box it in. All right, so now we got a little elevator. And you know what? Now I'm thinking about it. Why have a wall here if you could have an island here? You see what I'm saying? Had this all open. This could be all open concept. What about this? I mean, this technically could be open concept too, to be honest. And not have a wall, but that wall makes sense there. That wall definitely makes sense there. So I'm going to leave that wall there. But as far as this wall, I don't think I'm going to leave that wall there. I think I'm going to build islands i hope my monitor isn't spazzing out for y'all too that would be pretty unfortunate but we're gonna have an island i don't know how i'm gonna do the island yet but it's gonna be something like this oh there we go bro that was way simpler than i thought it was gonna be having auto counters on is very beneficial uh i didn't realize that just now okay so that's cool we got that going through there I need a little bit of light man I feel like it ain't no light coming through here give me that little bit of light all right so that's cool we got that we got the DJ booth I want to start giving y'all post notification shout outs man by the way I'm gonna start giving y'all post notification shout outs um these are gonna come from the sims videos real quick run through that real fast man big shout out to nakaya thrower you know what i'm saying big shout out to it's a nut <laughs> hey it's a nut bro what, what, what you talking about hey it's a nut was like it's not simless you feel me it's vlogmas you gotta respect vlogmas man shout out to it's a nut um shout out to kyra stevens Ty Murray, always showing love. Mary Rice, you know, always showing love. Kales, you know what I'm saying? Look like LL Kales. I rock with you, bruh. I think you was the one said you was from Cleveland. Uh, big shout out to Drea, Carmella, Kevin Hughes, and then, <laughs> did that last comment say, I'm, oh, it said, it said I'm white. I'm white. <laughs> okay, bro. You telling me, fo? Uh, and then on the vlogs, I'm gonna get somebody a shout out on the vlog playlist, bro. Shout out to all the people that watch the vlog playlist. This won't take long. <laughs> uh, Dr X Driz, you know what I'm saying? New weekend reminds me of you and your pops in that one video. Facts, big facts. Uh, Kiki plays Roblox. Mark Williams, you already know. Casey Fall, Sierra Bellamy. Elizabeth Crite, you know, Braxton Taylor, Trey, rock with all of y'all, man, for real, for real. I see everybody's comments. I, I look at the comments a lot on my uh, on my vlogs and my sim videos uh, for the first couple days. All right, so I really want a shiny floor, man. You know, I really want some shiny floor, some modern floor looking stuff. 
I was following this girl. Actually, I was on my Explore page, and I saw this girl take a picture. And then, you know, as much as I like carpet, y'all know I love carpet. That hard, that not hardwood, it was, uh, what was it? It was like marble. It was like polished marble. And it looked so good. It wasn't like this, though. I don't know if they got anything like that. It was more square. It was kind of like this, but it was like polished to be shiny. It looks so good. I might just throw the picture up if I if I really want to show y'all what I'm talking about. Uh, yeah, so that's cool though, man. I kind of like this. It's got a nice little vibe to it. I do want to split this up just a little bit. You know, I was thinking about it the other day, man. We got to do we got to do a collab with Carmen, man. Carmen King. I've been talking about collabing with Carmen forever. We did that Fortnite collab, and Carmen mad cool. Like, remember I was talking about you got to be careful with some of these people cuz they fake. Well, you got people out here that's really genuine too. Even though you don't talk to them all the time, you could just feel that they're genuine people. And Carmen is definitely one of those type of people. I don't talk to her often, but whenever I do, whenever I needed help that time, you know what I'm saying? She really had me faded. She had me covered. So I appreciate that. So we need to do some kind of collab. The thing is with me and collabs, bro, like I really don't know <laughs> me and collabs. That's not like Mia Khalifa. Shout out to Mia Khalifa. <laughs> nah, for real, though. Uh, me and collabs, I don't even be knowing what to do, man. For real. Like, unless we plan something like Call of Duty or Fortnite or something like that. Like, how you going to collab on The Sims? I don't know. But regardless, I rock with her. And she already know that, so it's all good. Regardless. I'm just going to turn these black. She, um... Yeah, I like that. That looks good. And then for the wall color, I'm not sure if I want to go with, like, Cause I want it to kind of look masculine You know what I'm saying Like a masculine kind of vibe And that's what I'm getting with this color You see it? You see the masculinity Coming out right now Now maybe I could go ahead and do something Like this too to really give it that look Maybe Yeah see look at me designing Like hell Let me, I might go overboard with this but I just want to see yeah, That's a little overboard yeah, I like this though. I really hope y'all don't see all this fuzz. Man, I can't believe it. So my whole life I ain't ever drank coffee this much. But it helps, man. It helps me get these videos done. Mostly for Vlogmas. Like I'm recording this right now, but I gotta do videos for later today. I probably shouldn't even be recording right now, but I got to. You know what I'm saying? Gotta get these gotta get these videos out, man. It's funny cause it's like I work a lot of times I work like I have a million subscribers getting 15, 20, 30, 50,000 views a video. And I don't. But, you know, I feel like if you need if you work that way, if you work like you do, eventually you will and you won't have to be like stressed out and you you already know the process. Like you already know what's up. You don't have to be stressed out about it. Cuz I'm telling you, bro, we going to make it, man. It might take a minute. I might be 50 years old before we do. <laughs> but we go make it. You feel me? I'm not giving up on, on none of this. I'm not giving up on the music. I'm not giving up on the, the YouTube. I'm just not. You know what I mean? There's no benefit for me to give up on this stuff. Uh, so we're not going to. Plus, I mean, have you seen the vlogs? My quality is so good now, man. It's like I really can shoot a movie. Like, I could really work for another YouTuber and shoot their intros and stuff. Like, it's crazy good. So, if you're in the Cleveland area and you're a YouTuber, which I highly doubt because that would be very rare, uh, let me know, man. We could do some stuff together and make some moves. But honestly, I'm down with helping little YouTubers, too. I told you, that's like my dream job, man, is to help people that... Uh, you know, don't really know what they want to do, but like find that talent and make it great. That's one of my dream jobs. For real. Just because I know how important it is. Like, 
that's something that I need right now is somebody that does that. And I might be working with some people that are, but uh, to be able to do that for other people, that's a good situation. I don't know if I'm if I'm liking that red or not with this with this table. I just made it red for the heck of it. Might go with that blue actually. Depends on what color I want to make this picture. I like the first one, but wasn't it, wasn't it another one that I liked a lot? It was a couple of them that I liked, but what is that one? I can't see that one. Oh, that's got the afro. I'm more a fan of the dreads, though. I ain't gonna lie. Oh, was this one? That one was the flyest one. That yellow. It ain't nothing to match that yellow. That one was dope too. I remember using that one in the other house. Uh, shit. We're not supposed to be sitting here waiting all this time, Sonny. Have y'all y'all got hip to the whole thing with uh, YouTube and their new rules and all that? I really wish this one was dreads instead, but it's alright. I kind of like it. It's green, though. You know, I haven't never used green in a house as an accent color. This will be the first time I do that. I don't mind it. It looks kind of good, honestly. So that's what we're going to do. We're going to make all the windows black. <laughs> Imagine this being your college dorm, bro. Like, for real. That's what Mary Rice was saying. I saw her in the comments. Like, <laughs> my dorm look crazy. It'd be crazy if my dorm looked like this. I know. If people's dorm look like this, man, it would be like. But honestly, that's the thing about college, man. If you got a lot of money, you can go to college like this. I mean, I don't know that life. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I don't know nobody that knows that life. But there are people that, that have a lot of dough that like live in these nice cribs while they're in college. And I couldn't even imagine. That's got to be so lit. I won't be living through that, but maybe my children will. Who knows? Because at the end of the day, Family Channel coming soon, right? <laughs> Gotta have a family first, Sonny. Yeah, I know. I know. Gotta get a family before you get a family channel. I know the rules, you know. Don't want to hear them, but I know. All right, so we're going to make everything that color for right now, just so I can get an idea of what's going on. I kind of want to take this roof off so I can get a better idea of the colors in this house, but I don't know if I really want to. This part of this house is so beautiful. I can't even get over it. We need a coffee table though for sure. This is going to be one last little decorating episode before I get into playing it. Because I'm going to definitely play it if y'all get them vlogs to where they need to be. You know, I wasn't expecting liking that table, but it don't look terrible. I wish this one looked better. This is one that came with the Sims, I think. It's not terrible, terrible, but it's not great either. It's definitely not bad. It kind of matches the like rustic. I wouldn't say rustic, but like the kind of masculine look in this house. What happened if I pulled all of these back one? <laughs> Y'all, the day I uploaded The Sims, I almost didn't get a video out that day. I was um, <laughs> I was editing so much that I lost track of time, lightweight. And I was like, yo, I forgot I got to put a video out today. But it's all good. I think after today, I'll be able to keep up with Vlogmas for the most part. Where I won't get that far behind. Because it gets a little stressful, man. Mostly with me, because I told I said, man, I'm not letting up. I'm not getting, I'm not taking no days off this month. It's all month you getting one video a day at least. At least. At least. I need a rug, man. Bad. Right now, that's just going to have to do. I don't like this bedroom. It's way too dark up here. Way too dark. I kind of want to bring some of that stone accent up here, but I just don't know where I would. Because that looks terrible. Well, I guess it wouldn't look terrible if it was like, if it made sense. It don't make no sense. 
<laughs> make no sense. Uh, nah, make no sense. Hey, hey, young boy. Uh, you know hey, yeah. Hey, yo, uh, why am I like? <coughs> yo, I became a big fan of Young Boy, man. I'm not even gonna lie. Young Boy never broke again. NBA track star 2K14. You feel me? I became a huge fan, to be honest. Kind of out of nowhere, but I ran across one of his uh, songs one time, and then he dropped the album, and it was like, yo, I rock with this dude, man. I like the sound. I always see the memes about how diehard his fans are, too, <laughs> which was kind of funny. But, yeah, I, he got some dope stuff. I ain't gonna lie. I ain't even gonna lie to you. Man, I need something, bro. Don't judge me on those yet. You can judge me in a minute, but don't judge me right now. I'm just trying to trying to lighten it up up here because it's kind of dark up here. I want the house to feel masculine, like a masculine, modern bachelor crib. That's what I want this to feel like. And right now, I think I'm succeeding, to be honest. Y'all be the judge in the comments, but right now I think I'm succeeding with that that look that I'm looking for. Like you could imagine, you know what I'm saying, young bachelor, rich LA uh, bachelor type vibe. Coming home, got the carpet in the bedroom, carpet in the living room, but hardwood or hard, not hardwood, but hard floors everywhere else. You know what I'm saying? I like this though. I like that black. That black with that that brick looks so much better. A lot of times that all white stuff looks good in person, but in this game the darker colors look better. The bedroom needs help. Bedroom needs big time help. But far as the kitchen goes and this little living room area, honestly, I had a couple pictures on the wall and I think I didn't made this a uh, pretty official. And then I just might go ahead and go into the story with this game not play too much around with like what's going on I'm just putting these here to see what's up see what I got in here it might go I really hope y'all don't see this monitor jumping and spazzing out like it is I really really hope you don't alright so pretty much I like this bottom floor a lot. I don't know, I symmetricalize that. Don't ask me why I always say that, because I don't even know why. Symmetricalize is not even close to being a word. But I make it a word. Every time I'm decorating in this game, I make it a word. Um, but when you think about it, like, what is a word anyway? You know, that happened to me the other day. I was making some shirts for my mom because she wanted some shirts for her friends at work or something for Christmas. And I was looking at this text so long because I was trying to find a text font for it that the word started to look like it was spelled wrong. I'm sure y'all probably have ran into this happened to you before. And it's so weird because it's like you're looking at a word that you know is a word, but like you've been looking at it so long, it starts to not even look like a word. It's just like... What is this? Just numbers? I mean, just letters? But when you really get deep, like, what is a letter? You know what I mean? It's just like a line twisted in a certain way. I get deep, man. I'm just saying, I get deep. That's also what your girl told me. But I'm just saying. <laughs> All right, so far as the toilet room, I want to go ahead and put... I don't want to spend too much time in here. Even though I definitely do want to make a nice, modern... I probably should spend some time in here. I'm not even going to lie. Because I would like to make a custom shower. And the only way a custom shower is going to work is if I use the nice stone wall. And then really put the time and effort into it. To build the shower. And... I don't mind doing that. They actually have showers now in the game. It's only a three, though. 
Don't I got one that's higher? Yeah, I got a 7. 7338 and a 7338. Okay, so these are both 7338s. Uh, I think I'm going to just go with this 77338 or 7338. Put one here. All right, clearly those don't work anymore. So <laughs> maybe I'll go with this 77. All right, that one doesn't look like it works either. Does this one work? Nope. All right, I must have something that's broken, clearly. So I had to use the basic showers, which is fine because they actually they actually stay like they're supposed to. So that's fine. I'm going to go ahead and use day showers, but I am going to put some windows in here. I'm going to put some, uh, guess, give me some two-story thinnies. Two-story thinnies. And then I'm going to take the wall and just make that the stone part. And then I'm going to put... Build my own little wall here. You know how I like to do it. And then that could be there. But when I put the walls up. Oops. When I put the walls up, I might want to do this stone too. I don't know yet. I don't know if I like that or not. I might go ahead and bring it back a little bit too not quite sure and I want to use this little bit of trim trim that up like that and then take this floor and give them something different like some rock action or something be the nigga ass like I'm the rock let's go yo the baby one of the hottest rappers out right now I'm just saying he really is I don't know if people rock with him as much as I do cause I, I definitely um, rock with him, but I didn't know he was original. He was born in Cleveland too, which makes it even better. Like he's a hometown boy. Like what the? F I'm not sure what kind of floor I want to go with in this shower yet, but right now that's what we're gonna go with. You know, I kind of want to change this. I know I don't want to spend all day doing the shower, but I almost want to do something like different. Let's do this, but I'm gonna make the whole thing this color. Yeah, I guess it already kind of made that happen. I'm going to make the whole thing that color, but the floor needs to be different. I don't know what I'm going to do with the floor. But it needs to be different. See, I like those rocks, but it just they don't look right. I don't want to spend all day in here, neither. Because I got other stuff I want to do in here before I pause this episode. So we ain't going to spend all day in there. I need a toilet and a sink. Matter of fact, I'm not even going to spend all this time in here. I just want to show y'all what I'm doing just in case I go ahead and finish it up off camera because I really want to get into playing the game. But you know what? Maybe I'll hit y'all with another hour episode of The Sims. And if y'all show it a lot of love like you did before, I could go ahead and put some more time into, into playing The Sims, making The Sims. I got another good idea for the vlog, Miss Man. I'm going to react to my old family movies family tapes is what we used to call them <laughs> in my house family tapes but basically home movies man i thought about it the other day like i don't know if i'm gonna do it with my mom or do it by myself but i was like yo that would be a cool idea to react to the family tapes family movies because it brings people into your family that wouldn't have known you and your family at all plus it's like you get to relive some of it which if I do it with my mom, I already know she's going to be crying. She's going to be crying heavy. So <laughs> I don't know how we going to do that yet, but she definitely going to be crying. And yes, I know crying is the way you say it. But like after I heard the Hodge twins say crying, I was like, yo, that sounds way cooler to say it that way. So why are you crying? definitely got to get that to the Hodge twins by the way man people react to their videos first of all I should have been doing that years ago y'all know I've been rocking with the Hodge twins man before I even started YouTube since like 20 
2012, I want to say, because it was right after my dad died. Actually, it was a little bit earlier because my grandma was still alive. It was like 2011, I think. I started watching their videos like 2011 because it was right after my dad died and my grandma was like in the nursing home. So yeah, 2011, I've been rocking with them, which is a really long time. <sighs> Crackhead alert. Um, <laughs> which is a really long time to be rocking with a YouTuber, man. But I don't know, they're just like family at this point. I was watching it's, uh, Keith's daughter, Dana, the other day, and it's crazy because it's like, I feel like they all family. It's, it's, it's crazy. It's definitely crazy. And I'm sure some of y'all feel like that about me, and it's just such a cool bond. Like, And I know a lot of YouTubers, like that's the difference between me and a lot of YouTubers. Like they, I don't really look at y'all as like fans. I still got crust in my eye. Uh, I don't really look at y'all as like fans. I might say fans just as a general statement, but like, like when it comes down to the come down, man, like I rock with y'all. Y'all know that. Like a lot of times I hit y'all up on Instagram, hit y'all back on Instagram. We kicking it. Just trying to be, trying to find people that's on the same wavelength as me. Just trying to get out here and get some stuff done. And, uh, that's what I'm on. You know what I mean? I don't know what I'm saying at the moment because I'm trying to get this whole thing together. But, yeah. So, basically, what I'm saying, though, is, yeah, I rock with y'all, man. Regardless. Um, See what I was thinking? Because I like to have a toilet in a separate room. It just feels more realistic to me. But if I do that... I mean, it's not that it feels realistic. It just feels like if I had this kind of house, like usually nice houses have private toilet rooms, which I can't say I love f far as sitting on the toilet. Like I'd rather sit on the toilet in a big open bathroom than sit on the toilet in a little hole. But you know, whatever floats your boat, you know what I'm saying? Whatever floats your boat helps you find the lost remote. Uh, but personally, I would like to just sit in the big open bathroom. But if you got a wife and y'all you both need to use the bathroom, you know, this is beneficial because you don't have to smell each other's turds the whole time, which I could imagine is pretty disgusting. So as far as the bathroom goes, you already know, hook that up real quick. I forgot to put a drain in, but they already kind of put their drains in. I love these headbands, man. Big shout out to the dude that told me to make these. I got to put him on the screen or her on the screen because that was the best idea ever. I don't know if you watch the video, all the videos. So I don't know if you even see this shout out. But if you do, big shout out to you. Make sure you post in the comments because that was a big, that was a good idea, man. Really good idea. Hit the DMs. I want to get a number for y'all, man, so y'all can call. The only thing with the number is, like, I want to get a number that's kind of okay if it gets leaked out. So, I don't know. But I definitely want to have y'all where I can meet more of y'all. Because I'm looking for talents, man. I'm looking for people that's on that same wavelength. I'm telling you. I'm not playing with this stuff. It's too much talent out here and too many people that's, that's doing it. We could be doing it too, man. We don't have to be big to do it. And I need a damn songwriter bad because, <laughs> but I'm, I'm working, man. I'm working. I got a couple people lined up. Big shout out to them. I ain't going to expose them yet because my songwriter got to be, uh, my songwriter got to be, uh, unknown right now Fuck. I need a rug bruh that is not the type of rug that I wanted but it's like at this point I'm just gonna go with it because I can't find a rug that, that works and then do you think they're gonna have a long mirror for me I doubt it but that kind of works right kind of See, the problem with this is like, it does work, but it's just not quite big enough. You could go 
multiple mirrors over. I'm gonna beat a nigga ass like I'm the rock. I could do something like this though. Let's go. Yeah, that's decent. I mean, it's not. Uh, is that decent though? I don't like that. That's just a kind of a cop out to me. But I don't see no longer windows. I mean, longer. I might not put music in this video either, by the way. I don't know. I like putting music in these because it kind of opens up the space some. But at the same time, the fact that I got a copyright strike, or not a strike, but a copyright claim, gets, you know, a lot of times that's what takes me so long to edit, trying to find music to put in the video. Cause like before I didn't never put music in my videos, but then I saw I did a poll one time and people was like, oh, it makes the videos better. So I was like, all right, bet I need to put music in the videos. But sometimes it ends up taking me longer to find good music to put in. It doesn't ruin the video because some people use the same songs over and over, which ain't nothing wrong with that. It's just sometimes the same songs don't fit the same vibe. So like if I use like that uh that was pretty accurate. If I use that song, that's like some kid Barbie doll make a craft video type vibe. That's not what I'm trying to have when I'm doing a vlog. You know what I mean? But it is what it is. I'm looking for the robes. I probably should just type in robe, shouldn't I? I don't use the search bar enough. And I should. Because it clearly makes everything a lot easier. So you can put the robe over there. Maybe a towel rack in here too. That was so accurate, man. I'm, I'm very satisfied with how accurate that was. All right, so that looks pretty cool over there in the corner. I probably should put some tiles on this side too, shouldn't I? If you want to. Y'all, I want to I want to do a music collab. So y'all post your lit playlist if y'all have any. Send them to me. I don't think I need nothing over here. Maybe something on the wall if I can find something small and thin. But can I find something small and thin that don't, it's not about to take me years to find? Something like this, but a little longer. That's kind of specific, I'm not gonna lie. I got an Acura sign? What is this? I don't remember ever seeing these. What are these? Oh, these are like signs. All right. Well, I'm not about to use those right now, but I will throw them in the basement, AKA the garage, AKA the first floor to see what they do. I need to do an ASMR video. Clearly I need to do a lot of things that I talk about doing in these sim videos and I don't end up ever doing them. But they coming soon, bro. They coming soon. Y'all just got to stay on me sometime. I'm like a, uh, I'm like your parents when they say they're going to do something and then they forget. Y'all got to stay on me. Like, hey, dad, you remember when you told me that you was going to do such and such? I'm like, oh, yeah, I forgot. Y'all got to stay on me like that. <sighs> like I'm your father. Like, I'm your father. I think we good down here, man, for the most part. I mean, we could always tighten it up a little bit once we start living in it. But right now, that bathroom, let's go ahead and say this. That bathroom, that living room, all of that is looking very official. Very official. I think, I mean, maybe I could add some stuff to the uh, living room, but like just to decorate it up a little bit. But right now... I don't know man I'm liking this I'm liking this a lot I like the glass I love this picture 
like the green accents come upstairs you got some fly honeys on the wall I'm liking that it's private because that's a private bathroom I kind of wish that bathroom was the same size as the one up here though because if it was I could just copy and paste it <laughs> but it's not so you know I can't but it's all good it's all good I'll have to do that off camera because I'm not about to do a whole nother bathroom right now and then as far as the bedroom I think we could definitely add some couches up here or some chairs something something to give it more of a homey vibe to it I just don't know what kind I want to put up here yet I don't know why I put these up here. I'm just testing out, seeing what something looks like this big. This is the wrong way. <laughs> I'm like, why does this not look right? It's Cause it's the wrong way. So, I mean, I don't know, man. Would something like this look good up here? That's a question you want to ask yourself, Sonny. That ain't that question I know the answer to. I feel you, bruh. I feel you. Something like that, though. See, that's too much. I don't need something like that. I need something like a chair, like an actual chair that's more like a... Not a recliner, because those are ugly, but like... Like a big egg type chair. Like a beanbag chair almost. But like, kind of cleaned up some. Oh, uh, I might just have to end up going with chairs, to be honest. I might have to go with the chairs. girlfriend got ball hairs man hell no this is terrible all right I'm not seeing anything what I'm looking for right now and it's kind of it's kind of making me a little bit like where they at though I need something like this but like not this though those are not attractive enough at all. They're shiny and they look ridiculous. But something like that, though. Why don't you just use the, the things you had? I mean, I could just use these. They seem a little bit ridiculous. No more ridiculous than what I was just using, though. To be honest. If we being honest here. I mean, I guess I could throw these in here like that. They're kind of just like big fluffy chairs. I don't know. This is all kind of up for debate. So I'm not going to spend too much time here. Because why waste my time here? When I could waste it somewhere else. You know. Kind of sounds like relationship advice, right? Why waste your time here when you could waste it somewhere else? I don't know. I really don't know. I'm just playing with ideas right now. Bad ideas. Because that doesn't even look right there. But it doesn't look terrible there either. So, you know, it's just kind of like a I had to play with that and see what I can come up with type situation. But right now, everything else is looking pretty official. Now, I do want to add some lights in here. So y'all got to get ready for that because that's coming right now. I was going to make two episodes of The Sims today, but it looked like I'm going to only upload one. I just got a coffee stain on this damn desk. Not too excited about that, but it's all right. It's all right. You know what would be really cool? If I could put like a chandelier in here. But like, not an ugly one though. like a big modern crystal chandelier that would be so cool like a big version of something like this where did it 
it even go? Oh yeah, this is not gonna work anyway. This is like spazzing out. Um, I was just saying if we have any chandeliers. Look like the only one we got is this one. This tall. Which would mean it would have to go up on this floor, right? How does this work exactly? Wouldn't the chandelier go on this top part? I think I had to make that a floor though. Cause why the hell would you want a chandelier this close to the floor on that same level? Oh, I guess unless your ceilings were really high. Well, that's beside the point. We're not doing a chandelier anyway. We'll probably just do these little pocket lights that I made. These little lights right here. Because a lot of times, these little lights give off the most light anyway. I just got to place them right. I'll probably do this off camera, to be honest with you. Because this is going to take a minute. I don't know if y'all really want to sit through me placing lights. Unless I got something to talk about while I'm doing it. Which right now off the top of my head, I don't. But you know what? Maybe y'all trying to go to sleep right now. I couldn't imagine a more soothing way to go to sleep than me placing lights in the Sims. That's a pretty soothing way to slip in the slip and slide in the slumber. <laughs> Look at the slide in that. Nah, I ain't even gonna say it because this little key is over here. Even though YouTube is crazy with that now. Like, if you make little kid content, that's a bad thing. Who would have ever thought that was going to be the way it went? <laughs> I know I wouldn't have. You would have told me, like, kid content is going to get demonetized now. I would have been like, man, you a damn lie. But the government came in and put their foot in YouTube's ass. And was like, yo, can't have this no more. I feel bad for the kid channels, I ain't gonna lie. The toy review channels and all that. But then when you think about it, like, were they technically, like, exploiting their kids? Like, I don't, I don't look at it that way, like, personally. Like, I don't really think that because you have your children on YouTube, that means you exploit them. But at the same time... You know, you get some parents that really ain't the best type of people. And that's exactly what they'll be doing to their kids is exploiting them. So, I mean, I don't know. All I can tell you is if I had children, they would be on my YouTube. That don't mean I would be exploiting them, though. It would just be mean I'd be having a family vlogging channel. It'd be like Ace Family or something. Alright, so now we gotta do the top floor. Can I even put lights up here? I don't even think I can put lights up here right now. Because this doesn't have a floor, technically. You know, that's really annoying with this. Like, the fact that they act like this isn't a, a level, and I can't put lights up here. That gets on my nerves. But it is what it is. We ain't gonna trip on it right now. I'm gonna just go ahead and put lights up here instead. Get some nice spacing going. I try to be as symmetrical as possible without taking too long doing equations and all that. That was pretty even. Yeah, there we go. That ain't bad. That ain't bad. Oops. Alright. Now, as far as the whole crib, I think we pretty lit up, except the fact that the top floor isn't lit up. I probably could have used smaller lights, shouldn't I? You know what? I think the other day I did, didn't I? I was using... I was using these lights or these lights 
these look like they give off more light than these. And I was putting them in between because I think these give off more lights than this. Yeah, they do. See how much brighter these are? Damn, I wish I would have known that. All right, well, you know what I'm going to do? Off camera, I'm going to probably switch out and do that anyway. I'm going to probably pause this episode because it's about to be an hour in. And it doesn't even need to be this long. To be completely honest with you. I do want to line this garage up with them though. At least get the, the layout, the grid layout going. This is one off. There we go. Like that, like that. Yeah. I ain't got quiet on y'all, didn't I? My bad. I was just trying to get that done. All right, so I really, I really need to come back in and make sure this is all. Are these the right lights, though? Because I feel like these are giving off the spotlight effect. And the ones I want, oh, I think these were the right ones. You know what? We're not about to spend all day doing this. We're just not. I just want to leave something to remind myself that those are not the right ones on that side. Because I probably end up doing a lot of this off camera, just tightening up the little things that I don't talk through, that I end up playing music through. And I would play music with y'all, but you already know the copyright scenario is pretty bad. So right now, let's go into tab mode. Right now, you can't lie, bro. This is this is supreme college living right here. I mean, it's not even finished and it looks amazing. I love the way the kitchen looks. The kitchen is I I really like that too. Now, what I might end up doing is I might make an elevator to go up maybe expand that fireplace back not quite sure because i could do that i could take the elevator up another level and then go ahead and push this wall that i got this picture in this fireplace push it back give more space into the living room instead of having stairs there but if i push that back that means the kitchen's going to be kind of in the way too I could always taper the kitchen back in some. But yeah, this looks good right here. This is real nice. <laughs> I like this a lot. For real. This got a real nice look to it. Look at that. That's that's nice, man. I don't know if I want to keep the stairs or not. I kind of like them. But then at the same time, you know, you walking up the steps... You get you some buns and some and some nice shape going before you hit the bedroom. The bedroom needs help. I'm not going to lie. I might even make these ceilings taller because these ceilings are kind of low coming from down there. So I might make the ceilings a little bit taller and this bathroom is just completely empty. I think this is pretty, pretty nice, though. Definitely love this kitchen into living room area like this. All it is is gorgeous. I probably should decorate for Christmas in here. I didn't even think of that. It is Christmas time. Show me what a tree would look like. All right, all right, bet. That's what I'm going to do. I'm going to show you what the tree would look like. I got to find it first, though. Use your search results. I don't even need them. There you go, right here. Let's make it bigger. Damn. This would fit in here, but it's just a little bit too big right now. I'm not going to delete this DJ booth. I like this in here. It's a college house, man. You know what I'm saying? You need a DJ booth in your college house. Why couldn't I put this here? What's it saying? I'd inter interf interfere with that light? Who cares? Bro, y'all really about to play me like this? 
I swear they need to do something better with these lights in the next Sims. Like lights should not interfere with my life. Like why am I putting lights on a on an area that has no light? That no has no ceiling, I mean. I should be putting the lights on the ceiling. But you know what? There is no ceiling. That's probably the problem. If I did that, I probably wouldn't have this problem, would I? Now can I put lights on there? Up there, I should say. Damn, now I can put lights up here. Alright, the problem was that I don't I didn't have I didn't have what I needed. That was the problem. But I got what I need now. And we about to go crazy with the lights. Because why not? Didn't you say you wanted to put the other lights up? Yeah, I did. I definitely did say that. Uh, and I put this a little bit too close. It's cool, though. To me, these are a little close, too. I think this might be off a little bit. Yeah, I think these are supposed to be over here. <laughs> these are supposed to be up one. Yeah, I know. I don't know why I'm still recording, but y'all coming with me, I guess. But then now I need to delete. See, when I delete these lights here, though, it's going to make it dark down here. And that, to me, is the Sims being unrealistic. That's the type of stuff they need to get together with Sims 5. Mostly the fact that they got ray tracing now in these new graphics cards, which means... It can like trace light and all of that, right? Because the fact that I have lights up here that aren't lighting the down part is the most dumbest thing in the world to me. <sighs> See how dark that is down there? That's because they don't have good light tracing in this game. And light tracing will make a game feel a whole lot more realistic. So the tree, is the tree a major go? I think the tree is a major go. Shout out to Flossie Carter. Who watched Flossie Carter, man? Anybody on here? Any here watch Flossie Carter? It's like a live stream. Uh, does anybody in here watch Flossie Carter? I want to know. Because if y'all do, I'm rocking with you. I'm rocking with you even if you don't. But it's like, if you do, that's even better. Because then I could be like, such and such, calm down. And you understand what I'm talking about. But if you don't, then that's fine too. I'm just trying to find the right lights. And clearly I'm not. See, I don't know if these are the brighter lights though. All right, put one down. That's one. That's the first one. This one clearly isn't bright. Neither is this one. But this one is. That one's not either. And that one is. But clearly, the brightest one is this one. So that has to be the right set of lights then. All right, so I put this one here, which I think I should move as tiny as it is. It's so hard to see that. I think I'm going to move that there. Man, it's so hard to see these. You know what would be smarter? If I placed them while they were big. See, that's thinking smart right there. How y'all been liking these long sim episodes? Like, instead of me breaking it up into pieces, they just really long. I kind of like it. I mean, because the thing is, is people that watch The Sims usually like longer form content. I mean, I do. sure that's even those aren't really even even but they even enough all right hey y'all ever had beef with somebody and them have a name well everybody has a name but you know what i'm saying 
And then that name, like every time you hear somebody use that name, it's just like bad. <laughs> I have that with a couple people, like, and I hate it too, because like I really hope I don't run into a, a girl or something that I really like, and her name is like Anna, because I got beef with this girl named Anna, and uh, <laughs> that would be really unfortunate if somebody was in my life named Anna. <laughs> And it just like bring back it brings back bad memories. But you know, you could always make new memories or you could change your name, one or the other. Like say you got beef with a dude named Henry, right? And then you meet like your dream man and his name is Henry. Like what you supposed to do? You supposed to just that kind of reminds me of Brody, man. Brody Jenner. His girlfriend's name is Caitlin. <laughs> or wife's name is Caitlin. And then his daddy turned into Caitlyn. That's pretty messed up. I would be highly upset with my whatever you want to call it if they turned into a female and named themselves what my girlfriend was. But honestly, if I was Brody, I'd be like, yo, look, bae, you got to change your name. I understand that was the name you was given. But every time I say your name, I think of my damn whatever you call it. You could still call him his daddy, right? I think. I think. I don't know. I don't know how they work. Whole nother league of people to me. But look at this, man. This is pretty dope. I kind of just committed to the putting a Christmas tree here, but it doesn't really have to go here. It could go somewhere else. Could go. Well, it really can't go nowhere else. It doesn't have to be that big either. See, the DJ booth is kind of in the way. Would it be bad if I put it upstairs? Yes, it would be bad if you put it upstairs, Sonny. Why would you put a DJ booth in your bedroom? That's a good question. That's a good question. I'm really not sure how I want to do this yet. Is that the only Christmas tree I have, though? Because I swear I got some other ones. Christmas. Whoever, who, who else does that when they spell Christmas? I still spell it wrong, unfortunately. I just need everything with Christmas. Can you just do that? Or do I have to have... Alright, so... This is one tree, which I kind of do like that purple. It's different. Just like this house. It's got a different look. We could go with something like this one. I think this is my custom content tree. We could go with something like this one, which I think is just the original of the custom content tree, to be honest. This one, what we just had, and then this really big one. You know, I kind of like this one, though. You know, this tree is big enough. I mean, my living room's not big enough, but this is actually big enough to put in this house. Hmm. See, I'm kind of torn now because I kind of like, that's that one. I kind of like this one too. I think this one you can actually decorate. I think this is one that's like part of the game for real. Where this is just like, just part, just in the game. I don't know y'all. I want y'all to post in the comments, what tree do you like better? This tree, which will be tree no, this tree will be custom content tree. The tree I'm on right now. Custom content tree. Custom content tree white. Or custom content tree green. Why did I say the color is the opposite of what I'm showing? I don't know. Custom content white or green. Or the Martin tree. We'll call this the Martin tree. The Martin tree purple and white. But you could just say the Martin tree. Or the forest tree. Which is this tree. Which one y'all like better? I'm going to leave the forest tree up here right now. Just because I feel like it just matches the vibe better. The Martin tree is dope. But now looking at it, I think the Martin tree is probably my least favorite. 
I like the uh, the custom content tree. But I think this is the I think this is the one. But I want y'all to I want to know what y'all think in the comments though. So let me know in the comments which one is your favorite. I don't know what to do with this DJ booth, bruh. And I don't want to get rid of it. But with this Christmas tree being in here, it makes it very difficult for me. Well, Sonny, you have to pick and choose your poison. I don't want to take poison. Who wants to pick poison? I pick no poison. How about that for an answer? <laughs> All right, so this is what we're going to do. I kind of like the way I did this because it's like, it's like this. Like you in the house, right? Which we are. Damn, I need to go up a level. All right, we in the house. You can't tell me, bruh. Look at the vibe, man. I'm just saying, like, can we make these houses real? It, does any of y'all that, that, that watch me have a have a degree in design or, like, know people that can build houses? Because I'm just saying, we can make an apartment building. Start a Kickstarter or something. I don't know. But I mean, look at this room. I mean, it's just so beautiful. Like you just, you come home from work. This is the elevator. You come home from work and you just greet it with this nice kitchen that isn't finished yet, but still nice kitchen. Then you walk into the living room and you just, you're able to throw on some TV, throw on your fireplace. Got this nice view, but that's beside the point. Love the levels to this house too. Love the, love the, the, the picture with the fireplace. That looks good. Love the bedroom up there. Ah, oh, this is nice. I really like this a lot. I like this one a lot, y'all. I ain't gonna lie to you. I know I say that about all my houses, but I like the levels to this. And it's not even done yet, and it still look this good. So I don't know. Hello? 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 I can't hear you. If you can hear me, I can't hear you. Shout out to my mom, man. Y'all know more about my mom than you ever have if you've been watching the vlogs recently. You know what I'm saying? Me and my mom hella tight, man. Be tight with your people, man. Just saying. It's all you got. I made that joke in my vlog about all, all how all my family dead and gone, man. You got to make sure you appreciate them before they gone, which I luckily did. You know, me and my grandma was like hella tight. Me and my pops was best friends. Like, so try to get as close with your family as possible, man. For real, for real. That's advice coming from me. And you know, I don't do nothing but give you the best advice ever. This is a nice crib, though. I'm just saying. At the end of the day, this was a big success. The bedroom needs a little help. I need to do the bathroom upstairs, and I probably can make this room look a little bit better. What else we got in here? Love this picture. Uh, there's beautiful, beautiful women on here. Beautiful, beautiful women's. Beautiful women's. Yeah, all right. So that's what we're going to do off camera, man. And then who am I going to move into this? That's the real question. Who am I moving into this house? I don't really know the answer to that right now. If I'm going to be a thousand with you, as nice as this house is, I want to move that girl in here that had that, uh, had that whole vibe going. Why is like the animation not working with this? I like this roof, but I feel like it's like, maybe I'll like it better this way. Yeah, that's not bad. I need to get my window game together though. Cause my window game is not together. Like literally the windows aren't together. But that's all right though. Cause they, they're not gonna all look right on the outside anyway. I like to make them look right on the outside, but they are just not going to. I'm just getting a look at the house from out here trying to see what it looked like and it looks so good i gotta find a place for my dj booth i might end up putting that in the garage 
I mean, I got the pong table down here. I could put foosball up here too. I don't know. The thing is, is I don't want to make my top floor cluttered. I hate clutter. Y'all should know this by now. But it's like, it's a college house too. But you got the pong table. So it's like, do I really need a foosball table too? Or maybe I can turn half my garage into a DJ booth. I mean, you know, it's kind of like pick your, pick your situations here. I really could turn half my garage into a DJ booth. I'm not even <laughs> turn half the garage into a whole party uh, situation. Have a dance floor and everything. Name it Tesla and put some lights up. I don't know. I don't know how I'm going to do this with the whole garage thing yet. But I might just turn half of it into a dance floor. I'm not even joking. This is a college house, by the way. Don't forget that. I'm liking this, though, man. This is a beautiful... <laughs> I hit the bulldozer. Imagine if I bulldozed this house and couldn't reverse it. Let's go ahead and save it. Because that thought just made me want to save it. All right. I think we good, y'all. I think we good. You know, structurally, this house doesn't make sense, I don't think, though. I think my architect people would be like, yo, what are you doing right now? I think I would need another post right there and probably another post right here to keep that stable. See, I'm, I'm an architect, kind of. See, I think, that, I think that makes more sense. Yeah, I think that's it. Cause that's giving it pretty much all the support on that bottom floor. So if you was an architect and y'all was thinking that, post in the comments. Cause that definitely didn't make sense. That would have not been structurally sound at all. But now I'm pretty sure it is. That looks really good, man. Let me go ahead and add another little piece of realism to it by adding another car out here. I got phantoms in here now? When did I get a phantom? Or a ghost? It's a phantom though. I don't even know. I don't remember it. I don't remember even downloading this. Uh I got a lot of new cars that I'm not hip to that I got. But what would a rich college student have? I feel like he'd have a Lambo, a vet maybe. A wagon maybe a wagon and a vet because he's not like rich rich but he rich enough you know what I'm saying like not rich enough to have this like the 370 some thousand dollar Lambo but definitely a hooked up a hooked up vet couldn't say that he would definitely have a hooked up vet or she it might be a girl character only reason I don't like playing with girl characters is because I have to date dudes. And to me, it's like, why do I want to date dudes if I could be a male character and date females? <laughs> That's why whenever I make a girl character, she usually is gay or lesbian. Because it's like, you know, I don't want to be kissing and doing all that to dudes. You understand what I'm saying? That's kind of dope, though. The yellow, yellow, yellow wagon. And then he got the yellow vet. And then we got a, I mean, we got the Hummer in here, but like, do we need a Hummer though? You know what I'm saying? Like what other car, if you had a vet and a G-Wagon, what other car would you have? Maybe an S-Class for some luxury? Yeah, an S-Class might would work. Maybe he got an old Fisker that don't work no more. And he can't find nobody to fix it because it doesn't exist. Nice storyline. Maybe he got the Phantom in there. I mean, honestly, this Phantom is nice. But, like, would you have the Phantom in the garage? Well, yeah. The Phantom wouldn't be the most expensive car, so you probably would have this one in the garage over the vet and the G-Wagon. 
I don't know about the Phantom, man. I don't know about the Phantom. I feel like the Phantom is cool, but like then that's like too rich. Maybe he got a GTR. That's still kind of high, but it's kind of got a college vibe to it. Maybe he got a red GTR. I feel like this GTR is too small, though. Like, the vet is more like an actual car shape. Well, I guess this is the same size, ain't it? Never mind. All right, well, I think he got a red GTR. Which is very college student-y. If you was rich to buy a GTR. Y'all know it is. Don't even act like it's not, because it is. You know it is. It's a very college student car. You get 50 years old, you don't buy a GTR. You know what I'm saying? You buy a GTR when you're in your 20s and your 30s. So let's go ahead and uh, put the GTR in there for his third car, or her car, third car, depending on who I make. And... Yeah, we're going to go ahead and end this episode here, man. I want y'all to post in the comments if y'all excited for a playthrough of The Sims University. And before I leave, I kind of want y'all to vote who y'all want me to play through as. We could play through as any of these girls or any of these dudes. Now, these dudes got bad outfits on, so they don't really... Or I could play through is like him, which is basically me. But I think y'all tired of playing through is me, to be honest. I don't know. You let me know. Or maybe make a new character altogether. I'm not sure. Right now, Pleasant is living in that house. They're not going to be living there long because they're about to get evicted in three, two. They gone, man. They gone. But I love y'all, man. Hope y'all enjoyed the house. And I'll see y'all in the next video if y'all get the vlogs to 2,000 views. Man, I need y'all to show love on the vlogs, man. Y'all want the Sims? You got to watch the vlogs. Because I'm trying to grow my channel. And I need people to really see that I can do more than just sit here and play this game. Because you know I can offer more to the world than the Sims. Like, come on, y'all. You know I, I, gotta, I, gotta, I got the mindset for it. So I love y'all, man. Peace. <laughs> All I wanna do is hug you Cause I like your steel And I did